Hey everybody, uh, today we're going to have a quick uh, Photoshop quick tip uh, dealing with the infamous Nick collection. Uh, for those of us that have been doing this a while, uh, we've all come to appreciate the uh, the tools in the Nick collection. Uh, some of their filters and some of their processes uh, make our life easier and uh, I've always enjoyed using them for years. Uh, as we know, uh, you know, Google uh, originally purchased them from Nick, and then Nick uh, sold it to Google, and then Google has, uh, you know, stopped all support for it, and uh, it's kind of been dropped by the wayside, and I now understand that it's being picked up by uh, on one. So, uh, so anyhow, uh, we have a uh, update. We all updated our Photoshop by now to 2018. And um, now the Nick collection is absolutely broken. Uh, let me give you an example here. Um, we'll take an image. I'll just open up one here and put it into Photoshop. And then I will go up to the filter. And there's the Nick collection right here. And I'll just select analog effects. And everything opens, so everything seems to be working. Okay. And I'll just come in and... I'll select a wet plate and put the effect in. And when I'm happy with the effect, I hit OK. And normally the Nick collection will throw it in, do the processing, and put it back into Photoshop. You'll notice what happened right here is Photoshop just flat crashed. Okay? Total collapse. Okay? So which means that the Nick collection is totally useless to us. Okay. So we have found a workaround that seems to work for almost everybody that I know. Okay, so what you need to do is make a slight tweak in the Nick collection. So let's go ahead and do this again. I'm going to go ahead and open up the same exact image in Photoshop. All right, and I'm going to go right into the Nick collection again, just like I did before. Analog. And... But before I do anything now, I'm going to make some changes. Okay? All the way down here in the lower left, you'll see a settings button. I want you to go ahead and click that settings button. And then you're going to have this dialog box here with interface, GPU, after clicking, OK, improve the net collection, right? I want you to click the after clicking, OK. And then we have a drop down option here. It says after you click OK here, apply the effect to a separate layer okay this we're going to change that to apply the effect to the current layer okay and then hit OK and now when I turn around and hit OK in the Nick collection it's going to apply it in Photoshop and it applied the effect to the current layer and Photoshop did not crash Okay, so it's a workaround so that we can still keep enjoying the Nick collection. Um, and hopefully the new company that now owns the rights to the Nick collection uh, will uh, update it and get it supported officially through Photoshop and that. But in the meantime, with this little tweak, we can all continue to enjoy the Nick collection. All right, you guys take care, and I'll talk to you soon.